Hello my dear kids, welcome back. Today we are going to learn about prime numbers and composite numbers. Let's start. In the previous session, we learned about factors and multiples. Can you tell me what are the factors of 2? It is 1 and 2. What are the factors of 3? 1 and 3. Factors of 4 are 1, 2 and 4. Factors of 5, 1 and 5. What are the factors of 6? They are 1, 2, 3 and 6. Did you observe something here? Some numbers are having factors as 1 and the number itself. This kind of numbers are called a prime numbers. So, a prime number has only two factors, 1 and the number itself. If a number has more than two factors, it is called a composite number. Here, 4 and 6 are composite numbers. Always remember, 1 is neither a prime nor a composite number. Also, 2 is the only prime number which is an even number. Let us do an activity now. Here we are going to identify the prime numbers below 100. Prepare a table of numbers from 1 to 100. We know 1 is neither a prime nor a composite number. Let's take 2. We know 2 is the first prime number. We know all the multiples of 2 are even numbers. So the numbers ending with 2, 4, 6, 8 and 0 are the multiples of 2. So we are striking out all the even numbers. Let's take 3. 3 is the next prime number. All the multiples of 3 are composite numbers. So we are striking out all those numbers. Next number is 4. We are already striked out this number since it is a multiple of 2. Let's take 5. We know 5 is a prime number. So all the multiples of 5 are composite numbers. So we are striking out all those composite numbers. 6 we are already striked out since it is a multiple of 2. 7 is the next prime number. So we are striking out all the multiples of 7 since those numbers are composite numbers. Let's see the table now. There are some numbers remaining. If you look into those numbers, we can see that those numbers are having only two factors, one and the number itself. So all those numbers are prime numbers. So there are 25 prime numbers between 1 and 100. They are 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, 13, 17, 19, 23, 29, 31, 37, 41, 43, 47, 53, 59, 61, 67, 71, 73, 79, 83, 89 and 97. Let's learn prime factorization. Expressing a number as a product of its factors are called factorization. If you are able to express a number as a product of prime numbers, it is called a prime factorization. Let's take the number 24. 24 we can factorize as 2 into 12. This is called a factorization. 24 is equal to 2 into 12 which is 2 into 2 into 6 which is equal to 2 into 2 into 2 into 3. Now 24 is having only prime factors. This is called a prime factorization. Today we have learned prime numbers and composite numbers and we have identified the prime numbers between 1 and 100 and we have seen that what is prime factorization. Can you identify more prime numbers? 
ஐ விஷ் ஆல் ஆஃப் யூ ஏ ஹாப்பி லேன்